A vision of Vela, Deceased Muse inspires the legions in the heart of Rome's golden age, a moment captured by Sir Peter Paul Rubens in 1616. We find ourselves amidst a pivotal scene where Deceus Muse, a Roman commander of law, addresses his legions. The painting is imbued with an aura of divine intervention and human fortitude. Deceus stands elevated on a stone pedestal, an embodiment of military prowess and leadership. His copper blonde hair and flushed skin are illuminated, casting him as the focal point amidst his soldiers. Adorned in form-fitting armor and a scarlet red cape that dances with the wind, he is both warrior and orator. Rubens' mastery lies not just in capturing this moment but embedding it with symbols drawn from Greco-Roman antiquity. The lion scalp trim on Deceus's boots, his griffin-ornamented breastplate, each detail is a homage to historical authenticity. As Deceus raises his muscular arm, he recounts an apparition, a divine vision meant to inspire his men before they march into battle. Each soldier clutches a golden staff topped with symbols of the Roman Republic. Their attentive postures signify rapt attention. The eagle hovering behind Deceus isn't mere embellishment, it's emblematic of divine sanctioning. Strands held in its talons symbolize connection between earthly endeavors and celestial approval. Rubens was influenced by ancient philosopher Justice Lipsius's writings about Seneca who hailed Deceus as an epitome of leadership, constancy, virtue, nobility personified. These stoic ideals are underscored by placing Deceus on a marble dais whose square shape symbolizes fortitude. The painting invites viewers into this intimate space where human valor intertwines with divine endorsement a narrative not just of war but transcendent virtues that echo through ages.